Hi folks, Michael Camp here. I want to share another reason why I wrote my new book, Breaking Bad Faith, Exposing Myth and Violence in Popular Theology to Recover the Path of Peace. So this has to do with the graphic that you saw in the beginning of this video and that you'll see at the end. Um, a little while ago, I interviewed a gentleman named Rob Schenk on my podcast, and he told me about a new product that is marketed to Christians who own guns. It's called a Bible gun case holder that looks like a Bible cover, but it's not. It's not used to protect a Bible or to uh, um, you know keep notes from someone listening to a, a sermon or something. Uh, it's used to house a firearm, a pistol, and an extra magazine of ammunition. So the company that markets this call, is called Garrison Grip, and they say it's a really hot item and very popular among Christians. So this is really, in my view, another example of what I call violent sacrificial religion. This is when people who claim to love God and to follow Jesus, uh, in this case, carry a weapon to punish wrongdoers. And they're doing it outside of any official law enforcement and training. It's a philosophy of gun culture that is counter to what Jesus taught. Jesus taught us to love our enemies and to fight evil through doing good and seeking restoration. And not through violence and sacrificing lost people. So in my book, I show how this works. I debunk the violent, retributive view of God, and I show how dangerous that approach is in our society. It, um, it causes uh, more violence, cycles of violence. It backfires. I also give several examples of how to practice a restorative approach to fighting wrongdoing and evil that is more effective and uh, brings more lasting positive change to our society. So thanks for listening, and I hope you check out the book, especially if you're concerned, like me, about this trend of private citizen Christians using firearms and a retributive approach to fight crime and wrongdoing.